And good evening, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is finally back. Uh, GAC 5v5. Enough of that three versus three bullshit uh, that I didn't like whatsoever, although I did still make Kyber in three versus three. So our first opponent is Overkill Killer. You see he's sporting his uh, fancy Reek portrait, which means he's... Uh, an opponent to not take lightly, obviously, if he can beat that. And he is from, where is he? Overkill Killer is of the GGC Guardians Alpha. Okie dokie. So he's already went. As you can see, he, he only stumbled once against my Bounty Hunters. Surprisingly enough, that team still gets some holds, but otherwise... He's uh, one shot at everything. He one shot at my Geos, one shot at my Newt Nest. And at the back there, he one shotted my GG and took out my Basilisk Sean Fallen EP combo. And then he killed my Darth Revan and left my Night Sisters standing, obviously waiting for me to go. So you can see from what he set, he does the same thing. He also likely has a. EP Bastlashawn in the back. Because um, he's not running with Darth Revan. Uh, he's running kind of the same bounty hunters and pretty much the exact same bounty hunter team that I ran, except he put Nest in it. And then down here, you can see he put his uh, Separatist droids with Newt, which means he used the uh, Grievous Nuke team most likely on my Darth Revan, which is smart. You know, one shot at it. Didn't use it to its full effect since I split off my Darth Revan and my Bastlashawn Fallen. And then he's got gas. Seven star gas. Um, I held mine for offense and I'm probably going to mirror match because uh, I think I out mod him 230. He's got a lot more protection than me though so that's going to be annoying. He kind of runs my, his the same way as I do. Protection primaries across the board. And then his Rex, let's look at his Rex. Mine is 311, 313, and so I'm going to outspeed him. So I'm going to get the hop. And on an AI, uh, when you play it against the AI, you can usually win the mirror matches. They're a little bit of a slog, but it's definitely doable. Um, he has one relic level higher on his arc than mine, so he's going to be doing a little bit more damage. Crit damage, crit chance set. Modded pretty much the same is mine. Let's just take a look at his echo. Oh, he went his he went speed for his echo. But he's only got 206 speed. Offense, offense. Go ooh, lots of offense. Okay. So like I can expect an EP Bastlishon Fallen in the back. Well, let's go straight at it then. So, against gas, I am working on the e uh, the CLS counter, which you can see is right there. I'm uh, working on my Stormtrooper Han actually to replace old Ben, which works a little bit better. But I'm not going to use it because it is 50-50 at best in my testing right now. Um, I'm working on Han Solo to Relic level 7. I got him to 6 this morning, but he's only Relic 5 for this fight, so I'm probably going to mirror match it just to play it safe because he only has one loss and I can't afford any more losses. So let us use my own gas. Yep, let's just do it. So I'm going to get the speed advantage, but I got to burn through his protection and he's got some more than I do uh, the days and everything's just going to get uh, Rex is going to cleanse it off so I think I'm going to armor shred him instead let's call 
arc. So as you see, it's going to take me a bit longer to burn through his protection. We're kind of even right now. Who's going to get there first? Looks like I will. Now it's the battle of the fives. So as you see, they're going after my Rex, and I'm going after their fives. Okay, here we go again. They, yeah, they can keep attacking my my fives for sure. That's not going to do anything. That's awesome, actually. It's a nice little trick. And back to fives. That's actually a really awesome trick for a mirror match. They will attack fives, taunting. Okay. And there goes Rex, too. <laughs> okay. Go get him, Echo. Yeah, you guys keep attacking fives. That is that works great for me. Okay, here we go. And he's down. Go away. Woohoo! <laughs> well, there's the elf in the room gone. Okay. Now, it's been forever and a day since I went against a Darth Revan team. Um, only Relic 4 is across the board. But Padme was my go-to counter for Darth Revan's back in the day. So I'm going to do that now. I am. It's been a while. So let's hope and pray. Hope and pray. They're going to go first, obviously. Let's get some protection up here going, boys. Although my Padme's fast. But they don't, don't got a Bastlashawn falling that I got to worry about, so... Call Padme back in. Get rid of that damage dealer. I don't need him one-shotting people. Just take that away. There we go. Confused is my friend. There's more protection up. Hmm. Let's play it safe. 11 stacks. Think that'll be enough? Yep. I played that wrong. Okay, there we got the, the healing immunity, so it is now mine. Finish them off, please, guys. There we go. Thank you. Not the greatest, but there is the two tough ones off the board. Okay. So, Separatist Droids. Uh, tough team. Don't want to uh, underestimate it by any means. Uh, this team also don't want to underestimate it. I'm probably going to... CLS this one. Um, get Nest off the board early. Don't leave Nest till the end. You got to kind of slow play it. 
which means I'm probably going to Jedi Knight Revan this one. No GG. GG's the scary one, so. Let's see if I can push back. Okay. Get B2 off the board, please. And thank you. There we go. Let's pass some buffs around. Of course they always target Jolie with that. Take some stacks off of B1. Bye bye Vanguard. Obviously... Magna Guard's gonna go here. Um, that is not the person you want to target. Let's call Jolie to get some protection and health back. There we go. Okay. Take that off of Magna Guard. Let's keep these foresight going. We're gonna pay that. I'm going to get rid of Magna Guard before I pay any more. Call lots of assists. Do some healing. Oh. Pay up. Actually going to turn this over to... Oh, what can I do... Pay up, heal, Newt's gone. So not super banners, but good enough for me. What you got in the back, buddy? I like it. Thank you. Oh, there's his Grievous. He put the Grievous Nuke team on defense. Oh, that is actually pretty smart. Yeah, good good call. Good call, because that team is going to blow through whatever I uh, put against it. Whew. Not, that's kind of smart, actually. Bounty Hunters with Nest. Now, Bounty Hunters with Nest. I don't need to waste my watt on this. What else do I got for Rebels that I could use? R2. R2? Or two could work. Give everyone some offense. Although, although Ezra's a cleanser. Hmm. We'll try our two. So the trick is getting to nest early. I'm gonna stun you right off the bat. Oh crap. Okay. Stun you. Get some protection gone.
The only problem with this is I need Ness to take a turn now. Come on, Nest. Uh-oh. Oh, this is gonna be enough to kill her. Yo, there we go. Got her, got her, got her, got her. Haha. <laughs> uh, it is getting scary with the with relics because you can definitely out damage this team before you get a chance to come around to nest to kill her like that. And I have gotten burned by that. I have gotten stuck and it is annoying. Okay. So what else has he got? Okay, okay. Karth team with L3. And really the Grievous Nuke team is the one to worry about. Because it will blow through what I throw at it. It will outspeed everything. Karth, Karth, Karth. Okay, what can we use Trey against first, right? Troopers. Can I trooper the Ewoks? No Paplu. Oh, no, there's Paplu. He is modded for speed. The thing is, I'm going to have to get through Shore Trooper first. Ewoks, Ewoks, Ewoks. Let's try it. Speed up, bitch. Okay, there's one. Two. Three. Don't let him get a turn. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, the Imperial Troopers, how they have fallen. Relegated to killing Ewoks. Okay. Now, I'm probably going to try a Karth just to get past the two taunts. And we, since I don't have to worry about bugs, there is a feat right now to use the two brothers, right? So we are going to use the two brothers right now. Sith. Maul. Maul and Savage. Still use my Savage even today. Okay. Um. Yeah, we'll, we'll use it. Focus on Scion. Yes, definitely. We'll definitely isolate you. You're... You're, I don't want to say more annoying than Zalbar, but you're kind of more annoying than Zalbar. A 
we'll just end up uh, annihilating Zelbar. Or blowing through him with damage. Bye bye. Okay, candy. Yeah, of course they're gonna pick on frickin' mall. Squishy, squishy mall. Bye. Whack, whack, whack. Can I get some protection back? If I can get it around to, uh... Let's see, let's give some to you. If I can get around to... Yeah, I'm not going to get around to his second special. So we will end it now. No protection. No protection gained. Okay. So now we got the nuke team and the mall team. The nuke team being the more dangerous one. I kind of want to try first order against the, the mall team. And then I'm thinking of burning cooldowns. On the nuke team. Uh, Visus could work against the nuke or against Maul. Let's take a look at that Maul team. I think it had what Chase in it. Okay, so this Sith Assassin is going to get out there. 247, so yeah, so they're going to go fast. I'm not too scared about the damage output, though. And I kind of want to play around with this First Order team. Let's do it. Let's just do it. Okay. So that should get me out front, right? Even though... Okay, where's my assist move? This one's the big one, right? General Hux, if General Hux had an advantage, he has, then call the other to assist. Boom, he's gone. So there goes the tenacity up. Oh, the counterattacks. <laughs> let's, uh, let's cleanse other Kylo. Get some turn meter. Tenacity down. We'll stun you. Forgot about the counterattacks. That was fun. Let's get some turn meter back. I don't want to stop playing. Tenacity down. Go get her, boys. Yeah, this uh this first order team, they just got a lot of damage. A lot of damage gonna like playing with them on offense okay this nuke team is going to just blow over everybody let's 
so we can put together kind of a hodgepodge team. I still like Clone Sergeant. I might, what I might do is I might move Jedi Training Ray. Ah, crap. I was going to say move Jedi Training Ray up. Put a Barris lead, Jedi, Jedi Training Ray, Wampa, Watt, and Shock T. So now let's take in a team to just burn their cooldowns. Yeah, Krennic, Krennic, go get some use. Yep, 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 gone, okay. Good, good, good. Oh, okay. So, a Barris lead, because... Uh, gain, gain max health. And at the start of each of their turns, they gain, they heal for what, 8%. So, you, 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 you. And then, Shock T. Let's try that. Because I'm still going to get to go first. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the shield tech on Ray. And they're going to pick away at her. Let's remove that taunt. Now we're going to put the health or the weapon tech on Wampa. And now, dispel. Taunt and crit hit immunity. Oh, they, they're not going to get any benefits with them. It still calls them to assist. So we're going to be calling in Wampa then. This went down pretty much how I thought it was going to go down. But, there, we'll stealth Wampa. Offense up, and Wampa can finish him off. Oh, not quite. Well, then we'll get some protection up. Let Shock T finish him off. Ta-da! That was a hodgepodge team. But it worked just like I thought it was going to. Okay. 1860 is that bad. So let's see here. So if he gets a 60 on my uh, Night Sisters, he's going to be at 1687. So that'll put him at 1787, right? Let me pen here real quick. So he's at 1627, plus the 60 for perfect, which puts him at, well, yeah, 18, 1687. And then he gets 180 for that last zone, which puts him at... Puts him at actually at 1867. So if he gets a perfect 60, he wins. Actually, if he clears it in the first shot, so it's for, for me to win, he's got to get a 52. A 52, which is scary. So he actually did really well. He did better than me on efficiency, actually. All right. So yeah, he's just got to one-shot me. 
well, that could this could be a loss here, folks. But we will see, and I will catch you in uh, about two seconds of your time, and I'll uh, we'll see how it goes. So see you in five seconds. And he got fifty nine banners. So that's awesome. Starting off with a loss. Oh well, still had fun. Later, till uh, next time, guys. Cheers. Hope you enjoyed that. Thanks. Bye.